Hi everyone, it's day one of Vlogmas. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to have you guys stop in, spend a few minutes of your day with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you're new to my channel, please consider hitting that little red subscribe button. I would love to have you come back and join us for future videos. Oh, Vlogmas, I'm so excited to be doing this again. Got my Christmas, ugly Christmas dresses out of the boxes. I'm so excited to see these. I haven't seen them all year. It's been a long year and yeah, I just love kind of dressing up and having a little bit of fun. Why should that just be for kids, right? So for our advent calendars, I've got a Carrick coffee of the day. I had this one last year and I did enjoy it. I did get a Lindt advent calendar for chocolate of the day and I, I do have a couple of advent calendars from well, some of them are by mistake so we're going to do this one first from the sip and savor wine this has got the ugly christmas sweaters and then i've got well i've got another one from them for 24 bottles and then i got a 12 bottle one from qvc and i have my countdown to new year's for the sparkling wine on order so that should be shipping so i will have it in plenty of time for the countdown to new year's so anyway if i have an unboxing or something to do i'll just kind of incorporate it in there otherwise i'm just going to try to do these as fast as i can so today we are doing our scentsy warmer so every year i get the limited scentsy edition warmers and Oh, this year I just spaced. I totally forgot about it. And when I went online, it had already sold out. But I did see another warmer that I liked that I wanted to add to my snowman corner here of Nutcrackers other than my little uh, one from Scentsy. I think I got him last year. So he's like snowman here. He's got a black buffalo, buffalo plaid jacket. And then you can move these dice around to just count down the days to Christmas. Alrighty, so that's him. So I wanted to, so anyway, I saw this one. It's the November warmer of the month. Sorry, I didn't get it in time to get it unboxed in November. Um, in November, it was 10% off. But right now on the website, if it's still available, it would be $70. I did get it for $63. So it's just a cute little snowman. And he's got some snowflakes cut out. He's got a cute scarf. He's got his carrot nose, some holly berries and leaves for his hat decorations. And these little sticks for his arms that do come out. And when I was trying to get my thumbnail picture, I accidentally almost stabbed myself in the eye. So be careful. So this one's a uh, heater element right here. So you put the pot right on there. That's going to hold your wax melts. And melt them to just the right temperature so the fragrance is just going to kind of permeate permeate and go through your house i love scentsy warmers the wax it's a nice safe alternative to candles so you're not burning the candles and getting soot on your ceilings you're not breathing in the smoke you're not if it falls over or the glass breaks it's not going to start a fire these warm up to just the right temperature so if your little one comes and sticks a hand on this they're not going to burn themselves yeah, it's going to be hot, but they're not going to get burnt. If they stick their fingers here in the wax, it's going to be warm, but it's not going to burn them. It's food grade paraffin. So if they go like this and then put it in their mouth, it's food grade paraffin. They're going to be okay. It's going to taste awful and they're not going to want to do it again, but it is safe. So it's just a fun alternative. Now, I didn't think that this one had a light in it. 
but it does. So anyway, watch your eyes, everyone, and let's turn them on. So you can see it just kind of lights up right here. And the light comes out of his snowflakes. So that should be a really fun addition to my snowman corner. I do have some more snowman nutcrackers downstairs, but I think that's probably all I'm going to pull up. I've got this other table to do with some other nutcrackers, but I'll just kind of do it here and there throughout the, the year. So in honor of my snowman warmer and sitting in front of snowman corner, I wore my snowman dress. So it's like this, like this eyelash kind of sweater material. So it's nice and soft and fuzzy. We've got this scarf here that you can use as a belt or you can wear it as a scarf. And of course, my little headband. So that's my outfit of the day. Alrighty, so for the coffee of the day. So I did get this one from Keurig last year. And it's got some flavored coffees in it. And then it has some regular coffees too. So it gives you a nice little mix. Those are the brands that are going to be in here. And so I will pull this out and then I will have it for my coffee in the morning. And for door number one, I have got from Caribou Coffee, I have got their reindeer blend. So it says cherry and decadent dark roast coffee. So that'll be what I have tomorrow morning. For my lint chocolate of the day, and I look for door number one already, so I wouldn't be struggling. And we got a little chocolate bear in gold foil, all decorated. So that should be fun. We will have that tomorrow. And I even bought little napkins this year. So I've got It's the Most Wonderful Time of the Year. So there's that. And, oh, you know what I wanted to show you too with Sensi? I also got some bricks. I got a brick. Yeah. So usually the wax bars I get are this size. I got one of these. So during the Christmas season, they come out with some special edition ones. Um, so this is a brick. It's like probably five times the size of that. But it's just really nice just to have a brick of, so you can get the same scent and use it quite a bit. This one is called Winter's Eve. And to me, it almost smells on the idea of like a men's aftershave. So it's like you're walking through the woods and it's like the cedar type Christmas tree. So you got that nice cedar scent and there's like a bergamot in here. So you got kind of like a citrusy, but kind of like a musky scent as well. So, and again, I'm gonna break these the same way. You can bend it, shape it. These are a little hard for me as I get older. So I just dump it out and I take a knife and just break the pep perforations and I'm good to go. Cut each block into a couple of different squares and pop them in your warmest and you're good to go. I know, isn't that great? All right, so wine. So I wanted to show you my new wine glass and I've got my wine in here just kind of warming up because I did have it, I took it out earlier and put it in the refrigerator, but I did want to have it on the warm side. So again, this is from Snapdoll and it's a little Etsy shop. And so I had these glasses made and it took her like two days to ship it and three days to get to me. So I got the one, the autumn one, and I got two of these for Christmas. So this is the ugly Christmas weather. So I thought that was a good place to start. The wine that I have here is the one from Sip and Savor. It's the holiday sweater one. And this is a Cabernet Sauvignon and Merlot mix. So I'm excited to try that. I love Cabernet Sauvignon. I haven't had too many Merlots, so I'm excited to kind of see what they're like together. So I got it here in my glass. You can see it is coating. It's a nice deep, deep, deep purple, almost like a black. Alrighty. I smell chocolate. Maybe cherry, maybe plum. Cheers, everyone. Happy Vlogmas. Mm. It's got the velvety texture of the Merlot. It's got the 
It's a nice, nice blend. I am going to enjoy having this and I enjoy getting to chit chat to you guys too. So, and again, like uh, I did last year, as I got closer to um, the end of Vlogmas and getting into the countdown to New Year's, um, if you guys want to, I would love it if you could send me a picture. It could be your thumbnail, could be a profile picture, could picture, could be any picture throughout the year or any year. You know, something a uh, happy memory could be a fur babies. And just at the end of the videos, I like to start playing the old Lang Syne as I get closer to New Year's, and then just do a slideshow of our subscribers because so many of us subscribe and watch the same people. And for people that don't have channels, it's just a nice way to put a face to the name and it's just a nice personal touch and it's my way of saying thank you thank you for being part of our family thank you for spending your time with us and yeah so anyway take care everyone stay safe oh, enjoy life have some fun dress up be crazy it's just not for kids and anyway thanks again for joining me and we will see you for vlogmas number two love you guys <laughs>